And Eikenberry, a longtime crew guy for the Madman. Second lap time for Kerry Madsen is better. 14, 8, 19, 1, 4, 8, 1, 9 for Kerry Madsen. Anthony Macri on to the clock this time. Macri from Dillsburg, Pennsylvania, driving with the Valley Supply, JNS Fabrication, CD Rigging, Randy Shear Plumbing and Heating, Macri Concrete, number 39M. It's the Concrete Kid, Anthony Macri. Macri, an all star winner last year at Port Royal. First lap time for Macri, quick time, 14, 581, 1, 4, 5, 8, 1. Macri, six wins at Port Royal a year ago. Also picked up a URC 360 sprint car win at Williams Grove Speedway. Second lap time for Macri is better, 14, 540, 1, 4, 5, 4, 0 for Anthony Macri. From Bloomington, Indiana, driving the Messiah Valley Transportation, Southern Pacific Farms, Border Tire, DRC Chassis number 11K. This is Craig Kinzer. Craig Kinzer in car number 11K. Kinzer, of course, working with longtime crew chief for him. Mikey Kemper goes 14.872 on lap one, 14.872 for Craig Kinzer. Based out of Bloomington, they basically had to shovel their way out of the shop the other day. 14.878 on lap two for Craig. He'll take a 14.872, 14.872, his official time. From Gettysburg, Pennsylvania, driving the SweeneyCars.com, Weigert's Livestock, Bruner Service Center, Sandoz Fruit Market, Racers New News Parts Warehouse number 48. This is Double D, Danny Dietrich. Danny Dietrich and his wife, Rachel, welcomed a son this past offseason, baby Emmett. His first lap time for Danny, fourth quick at 15, 364, 15, 364. He's working with Suitcase Jake, his longtime crew chief. Danny, the winningest driver in central Pennsylvania a year ago. Time for Dietrich, not quite as good, 15, 387. He'll take a 15, 364, 15, 364 for Danny Dietrich, fourth quick. Dietrich, always sharp looking carbs. The chrome red this year is on to the track. He comes to us from Springville, California. The True Star Energy, Dillon Risk Management, Valley Pacific, BTC Bank, number 33M is Mason Daniel. Danny Lasoski, the crew chief on the 33M, Brian Burkhammer, the uh, car chief on the 33M, and Mason Daniel, full time last year with the Outlaws. First lap time for Mason, going to be fourth quick at 15089. 15089 for Mason Daniel. Will be back for his sophomore campaign with the World of Outlaws NOS Energy Drink Sprint Cars this year. Sat on the front row of the 360 Knoxville Nationals a couple years ago. Second lap time for Mason Daniel. Second quick for Mason Daniel. 14, 742. 1, 4, 7, 4, 2. That'll push Danny Dietrich out of the invert in heat race number one. It with Craig Kinzer now in the heat race inversion bubble. He's an all-star rookie from Sykeston, Missouri, driving the TK Concrete, Maxim Trucking, Logan Contractors, Eddie Gilstrap Motors, number 55, it's 100%, Hunter Schurenberg. Hunter Schurenberg in car number 55. Hunter driving for car number Tony Vermeer. Chasing the all-star title, a rookie of the year contender as well. First lap time for Hunter. Fourteen six three six for Hunter, second quick. And second lap time is quick time for Hunter Schurenberg. 14, 338, 1, 4, 3, 3, 8 for Hunter Schurenberg. Battle bump, Craig Kinzer out of the invert. Kerry Madsen now on the heat race inversion bubble is Bradley Howard. Goes around and keeps it going. Bradley Howard. From Edders, Pennsylvania, the A-Lane Furniture, Stauffer Motorsports, Chad Baker Drain Clean, D-Rock Electric Company, number 49H. First lap time in 18.092 with a 360 in there. Gets through turns one and two better this time. His father, Bob Howard, a longtime racer. And Bob Stauffer, their grandfather, passing away last year. Certainly missed within the racing community. That JJ Racing 49H, second lap time for Bradley. Better, sixth quick, a 14.975, 14.975, sixth quick. Two cars left in heat race number one to take time. Right now, Kerry Madsen on the heat race inversion bubble. Hunter Schoenberg is quick time thus far to 14.338.
On to the clock from Sheboygan, Wisconsin, the Gibbsville Chiefs, professional plating, Scott Thiel Builders, Viking Massic, number 73, it's the big wheel, Scotty Thiel. Scotty Thiel in car number 73. Thiel behind the wheel of the 73 will be full time with the bumper to bumper IRA sprints, 15, 167, 15, 167 for Scotty Thiel, seventh quick. Needs to find about a half second out there to jump into the invert. Second lap time for Scotty Thiel. Second quick for Scotty Thiel. 14, 5, 12, 1, 4, 5, 1, 2 for Scotty Thiel. Second quick bumping the madman out of the invert. Mason Daniel on the heat race inversion bubble is the final car. The heat race number one rolls onto the clock from Caldwell, Ohio. This is going to be Chris Myers driving the pine tree towing and recovery. Here's speed shop. Benick shocks number 25 is Chris Myers. First lap time for Myers, eighth quick, 14,990, 14,9,9,0. Good to have our friends at Sides Bar and Grill watching. Jason and Paul in the gravy train. Second quick for Chris Myers, 14,370, 14,370 for Chris Myers. Second quick, that bumps Mason Daniel out of the invert. And now heat race number two cars. Is a, Sides Bar and Grill, I'm sure, bumping down in Memphis, Tennessee as Tyler Ross keeps things going, the 360, but keeps rolling. Tyler Ross from Lincoln University, Pennsylvania, the Livingston Lawn Care, Lefevre Electric, Rack Daddy, C. Adams excavating 75. First lap time for Ross is going to be 17865, 17865 for Tyler Ross, the first car in heat race number two to take time. Good to see Gravy at the Chili Bowl, one of the sides crew members. Gravy raced at the Chili Bowl this year. A legend. Second lap time for Ross is good for eighth quick. 14, 9, 13, 1, 4, 9, 1, 3. Eighth overall, but he is the first car in heat race number two to take time. Brandon Conkle onto the clock. Conkle from Stoutsville, Ohio, the Bob Tucker Enterprises, PM Services, BNC Excavating, Mom and Dad. Sponsored number 08. A big thank you to his parents. See Conkle just a couple of times here when we visit Southern Ohio. First lap time for Brandon Conkle. Seventh quick at 14.835. 14.835 for Brandon Conkle. That'll put him fastest in the group through two cars. Second lap time for Conkle. Not quite as good. 14.981. He'll take a 14.835. Seventh quick overall, but fastest in group number two. From Visalia, California, driving the Routine Racing, Hager Realty, Race Routine Foundation, Elliott's Custom Trailers and Carts, Fatheads Iowa, number 26. This is Corey Eliason. And uh, Brandon Conkle not able to get off the racetrack. You see him caught up there by our Mobile One banner and the Flow Racing banner. Always good to have Jeff Converse with us, the legend shooting all the action tonight. Good to have one of the best in the business behind the camera. Jeff shoots a good majority of our races. Tyler McKim on the wireless camera down in the infield. And Kane Runyon producing things. Gabby back home in Austin with Flow Social Media. Flow Racing doing all 61 All-Star Circuit of Champions races in 2021. Ken Osborne there, series official on the four-wheeler pushing Brandon Conkle off. They'll head to the scales after they roll off the racetrack and they have to cross the scales. New weight rule this year for the All-Stars. 1,425 pounds, a 25 pound increase. So 1,425 with the driver in the car is where they have to time. Right now, Hunter Schoenberg at a 14,338, the fastest as Elias will come to the green flag, the initial green. For Corey Elias and driving for car owner Kevin Rudine. Elias with a trio of all-star wins a year ago, picked up at the uh, season opener at Port Royal Speedway in March. And, a win at Valvoline Raceway over in Sydney, Australia. Quick time for Corey Elias in 14 202. 1 4 2 0 2 for Corey Elias. And Elias is certainly an all star title favorite coming into the 2021 season off a second place running points last year. Second lap time better. 14 109. 1 4 1 0 9. Quick time for Corey Eliason. Onto the clock, 
Full time with the All-Stars in 2021 from St. Mary's, New South Wales, Australia. The Mike McGee Associates, XYZ Machining, Winners Performance Products, Champion Racing Oil, FK Ronins, number 11. This is Ian Madsen. Ian Madsen goes seventh quick at 14745. 14745 for Ian Madsen. Sam McGee, the crew chief on the car. Kevin Osmolski, the car chief. And always great to have Mike McGee with us as well. Kathy McGee back home watching on Flow Racing. Madsen second quick in the group. Second lap time for Ian Better. Fourth quick overall for Ian Madsen. 14, 401, 14, 401. Fourth quick overall. Second quick in his group right now. The heat race inversion bubble looks like this. Elias and Madsen, Conkle and Ross as we'll start to bump cars out of the invert. This is the guy that won the All-Star race here in 2012. The last visit for the All-Star Circuit of Champions to Screvin Motor Speedway. From Columbus, Indiana, the Rush Truck Center's Ford Performance. AutoZone, Sage Fruit, Mobile One, number 14 is Smoke, Tony Stewart. First lap time for Tony Stewart is going to be 12th quick at a 14.951, 14.951 for Tony Stewart. Fifth quick in the group and popping around. Stewart picked up a 4.10 win in Arizona last week. $10,000 payday at the Wild Wing shootout. Seventh quick for Smoke, 14.542, 14.542 for Tony Stewart. Seventh quick overall, third quick in the group, and that'll bump Tyler Ross out of the invert. Brandon Conkle now on the heat race inversion bubble. From Woodstock, Georgia, the Star Pharmaceuticals, Abel Roofing, Big Golf, Sioux Group, number 14R, this is Sean Rahal. Sean Rahal last year converting to sprint cars, had a very successful IMSA career. Pavement racing on the road course, was the IRA Rookie of the Year one season ago. First lap time for Sean Rahal, sixth quick for Sean Rahal, 14-540. 14540. That'll bump Brandon Conkle out of the invert and put Tony Stewart on the heat race inversion bubble. Sean Rahal, third quick over in the group. Sixth overall, second lap. Better for Rahal. Third quick for Sean Rahal. 14 366. 14 366 for Sean Rahal. Third overall and second in the group. Brandon Kunkel out of the invert. Tony Stewart on the heat race inversion bubble. As Carson Short hits the clock from Marion, Illinois, the Zeller Construction, DRC Chassis, Angler Machine, and Tool. Number 21, Carson Short, a winner with the World of Outlaws NOS Synergy Drink Sprint Car Series and the USAC National Sprint Cars. Quite the diverse racing resume for Carson Short. First lap time for Carson, going to be sixth quick. 14, 452, 1, 4, 4, 5, 2 for Carson Short. That'll bump Stewart out of the invert. Short on that heat race inversion bubble, fourth in the group. Second lap time for Carson Short. Second quick for Carson Short. 14, 165, 1, 4. 165, second overall, second in the group. Tony Stewart out of the invert. Ian Madsen now on the heat race inversion bubble with two cars left in the group. Out of Caldwell, Ohio, the Pine Tree Towing and Recovery. Valley View Cabins number one. This is Jamie Myers. Jamie Myers in car number one. Myers ran with us last year at East Bay Raceway Park. First lap time for Jamie Myers is going to be 10th quick, 14 6 14, 1 4 6 1 4. 10th overall, 6th in the group. Second lap time for Myers, 8th quick, 14 5 35, 1 4 5 3 5. 8th quick overall for Jamie Myers, 5th quick in the group, missing the invert. This is the final car. And heat race number two brought to you by All-Pro Aluminum Cylinder Heads to take time for is Cole Duncan from Lockbourne, Ohio. Cole dives the Ohio Heating Helms Construction. Motor City Auto Transport Wolf Composites, number 22C. Of course, the Duncan name legendary in Ohio is Father Rodney, the crew chief on the car, and they quite, quite the formidable pairing. Going to be 17th quick for Duncan, 15, 201, 15201 for Cole Duncan. Gonna put him ninth quick in the group. Duncan, a multi-time All-Star winner in his career. Boy, when tracks slick off, that's a full Duncan roars to life. Second lap time better. 15th quick for Duncan, 14900, 14900. So Ian Madsen, fourth in the group. Sean Rahal, third in the group. Carson Short, second in the group. And Corey Elias and fastest in the group. And Elias and fastest overall. As we start group three from Leduc, Alberta, Canada, driving the Canton Directors, number 28. This is Skylar G. Skyler G in car number 28. G been full time with the All Stars the last two seasons. Going to run a true outlaw schedule this year for car owner Brian Grove. First lap time for G is going to be 18th quick, a 15 032. 1 5 Good to have Sean Logan watching. 
trans longtime supporter of Sprint Car Racing. Second lap time for Skyler, going to be 15077, 15077. He'll take a 15032, the first car in heat race number three, brought to you by Hunt Brothers Pizza. I know Tom Book, the coroner's watching at home. Justin Peck, the driver of the Book Motorsports, CoastalRaceMarts.com, BMI, RPM chassis, HP engines, the Tree Center. Number 13 is Justin Peck. Peck, an all-star winner at Macon, Race, Macon Speedway in 2017. First lap time for Peck, going to be 14.869, 14.869, 14th quick. For Peck, he'll be running for all-star rookie of the year. Sean Strasbaugh, the crew chief, on the car. Second lap time for Justin Peck. Is gonna, gonna be quick time for Justin Peck. 13.963, quick time for Justin Peck. On to the clock, he'll be a rookie in the 410 at Knoxville Raceway this year from Altoona, Iowa, the Jetco. Blondie Motorsports, Rob Seco, DeBerg Concrete, number 27. This is Carson McCarl. His fiance Peyton selling t-shirts out in the midway. First lap time for Carson, 20th quick, a 15, 118, 15, 118. I know John and everyone at Jetco watching back home on Flow Racing in Central Iowa. Jetco does a lot for Knoxville with the 360 Nationals. Second lap time for Carson, 15th quick, a 14, 885, 14885 for Carson McCarl. Puts him second quick in the group and 15th overall. He's a National Sprint Car Hall of Famer from Chillicothe, Ohio, driving the Kier Speed Shop JD Performance. Coors Light Gang and the Olive Branch Gang number four, it's Danny Smith. Danny Smith, we always wait for the uh, paint scheme reveal on the four. First lap time for Danny, 22nd quick of 15, 595. I texted him about it a couple weeks ago as everyone was patiently awaiting the much anticipated paint scheme reveal for Danny Smith, and here it is. Second lap time for Danny Better, 15 540, 15 540 for Danny Smith. Danny, one of the, the nicest guys you'll run across in the pit area, a Sprint Car Hall of Famer. From Fresno, California, the Logan Contractors, Aspen Air, Royal Flooring Team Excavating, Ted's Body Shop number 18. This is Gio Selzy. Gio Selzy in the 18. Check out the Flow Racing app. Chet Christner did an interview with Gio earlier talking about the power plane under the hood. Third quick for Gio Selzy. 14, 124, 14, 124 for Gio Selzy. Tyler Swank, Adam and Aaron on the car. Swank, a long time crew chief in sprint car racing. Second lap time for Gio. Quick time for Gio Selzy. 13, 731, 13, 731 for Gio Selzy. The new power plant under the hood. It didn't take T-Bone and gang long to get that thing dialed in. Making his all-star circuit of champions debut from Kannapolis, North Carolina, the Bow Marine, Millbridge Speedway, Nitro Kart number 70. This is Nick Tucker. Nick Tucker making his all-star circuit of champions debut. Just a couple of a world of outlaw starts under his belt. First lap time for Nick, gonna be 20 second quick, 15, 338, 15, for Nick Tucker. Little bitch, Speedway on the car where you see a lot of young drivers in North Carolina making their way through the ranks, cutting their teeth at Millbridge. 15, 164, gonna stay 20 second quick for Nick Tucker. Can tell you right now. My sheet will update for me. Gio Selzy fastest. Justin Peck second quick. Carson McCarl third and Skylar G fourth quick in the group. Tucker and Smith both missed the invert. Is this the Sam Hafer Teep Jr. from Sunnyvale, Texas? Townline Variety High Breeder Foundation Ackland Insurance and Original Traders Energy number 15H. First lap time for Hafer Teep eighth quick a 14 398 14 398 for Sam Hafer Teep Jr. Eighth quick overall for Sam. Second lap time, third quick for Sam Hafer Team Jr. 13, 971, 1, 3, 971 for Sam Hafer Team Jr. Gonna put him second quick in the group. Excuse me, third quick in the group should be 
This is Brent Marks from Myerstown, Pennsylvania, the M&M Painting and Construction, Bass Tunnel Paint Supply, Fredericksburg Eagle Hotel, Nice Crete and Landis. Number five is Brent Marks, full-time with the All-Stars this year, gunning for Rookie of the Year honors. First lap time for Brent Marks is going to be 14th, quick at a 14, 645, 14, 645. Marks, two times an All-Star winner in his career, coming in 2015. Second lap time for Brent Marks. 14, 532, 11th quick for Marks, 1, 4, 5, 3, 2. Making his all-star circuit of champions debut from Buena, New Jersey, the race quip, Franklin Racing Supply, Leeway Electric, Amsoil. Number 27C, this is Craig Pellegrini. Craig Pellegrini. First lap time for Craig is going to be 15-760, 1560 for Craig Pellegrini. Second lap time for Craig is better, 25th quick, 15-315, 15-315. Brent Marks on the heat race inversion bubble. Or excuse me, he makes it. Pellegrino is the first car in group number four to take time. This is a driver from Worcester, Ohio, driving the NOS Energy Drink Town. West Tennessee Expert adding Z-Max Lubricants, Hunt Brothers Pizza number 17. It's Sheldon Hoddenshield. Sheldon Hoddenshield in car number 17. First lap time for Sheldon. Fifth quick for Sheldon Hoddenshield. 14, 120, 14, 120 for Sheldon Hoddenshield. Kyle Ripper. The crew chief with Drew Brenner and Nicholas Goodflesh on the car. Quite the trio working on the car. Second lap time, quick time for Sheldon Hoddenshield. 13, 608, 13, 608 for Sheldon Hoddenshield. Next car on to the clock, a three-time All-Star champion from Clute, Texas, the Roth Enterprises, Jason Terra and Cole Roth Cattle Company, HR Livestock number 83 is Aaron Reitzel. Aaron Reitzel in car number 83. First lap time for Reitzel, seventh quick. 14, 245, 14-245 for Aaron Reitzel. One of Josh Hegwood's Chick Magnet Motorsports drivers. Big shout out to the Chick Magnet, Josh Hegwood. His second lap time for Reitzel. Third quick for Reitzel. 13, 9, 26, 1, 3, 9, 2, 6 for Aaron Reitzel. Billy Debates watching from Laverne, Minnesota. A big supporter of the All Stars as an All Star Rookie of the Year contender hits the clock. He's from Indianapolis, Indiana. The NOS Energy Drink Turbo, Z Max Lubricants. Clausen Marshall Motorsports at number 7 BC at Sunshine, Tyler Courtney. First lap time for Tyler Courtney. Fourth quick, 13, 943, 13, 943 for Tyler Courtney. Sunshine, fourth quick, a USAC national midget and sprint car champion now chasing an all star title. Second lap time for Sunshine is quick time for Tyler Courtney. 13, 595, 13, 595, quick time for Sunshine. An all-star rookie of the year contender from Neptune City, New Jersey, the Capital Renegade champion racing oil. Henry's record service number 91. This is Kyle Reinhardt. Kyle Reinhardt in the 91. Boy, I love a story like this. Kyle, an engineer by trade, has an engineering degree, said, I'm going to put that on pause. I'm going to chase a racing career. Ninth quick for Kyle Reinhardt, a 14, 259, 14259. Combining forces with Jeff McCall and Wayne Quackenbush, chasing an all star title. An all star rookie of the year honors is Kyle Reinhardt. Second like lot of time for Reinhardt, not quite as good, 14, 360. He'll take a 14, 259. Ninth quick for Kyle Reinhardt. Reinhardt fourth, quick in the group. RJ Jacobs onto the clock from Dover, Ohio, and the DAC Vitamins and Minerals, Sugar Creek Cartage, Ray Alderman and Sons, Simcox Grinding and Steel. Number 18, J, first lap time for RJ. It will be. It's a little bit of a delay here in timing and scoring, so I'll update it once I get it. RJ 
RJ Jacobs scores 14-8-23 on lap one. That's good for 21st quick for RJ, 14-8-2-1. Fourteen three oh seven RJ Jacobs official time one four three zero seven fifth quick. So Tyler Courtney thirteen five ninety five an All Star champion contender and rookie of the year. Contender up to quick time with a couple of cars left, two cars left in group number four. Brought to you by Mobile One. This is a driver from Fargo, North Dakota, the Car Quest Auto Parts Ford Performance. Mobile One, Sage Fruit, Curb Records number 15 of Donnie Schatz. Donnie Schatz in car number 15, the 10 time outlaw champion of the Tony Stewart Curb Agazanian. Number 15, and Donnie goes quick time, 13, 378, 13, 378 for Donnie Schatz. Schatz showed speed out in Arizona last week, second lap time for Donnie. 13, 216, 13, 216 for Donnie Schatz, quick time for Donnie Schatz. And final car here in Lincoln Electric Time Trials to take time from Vienna, West Virginia. The PM Company, Ravisi Racing, Bralex LLC, Precision Overhead Garage Door Service, number three, CS Kale Conley. And no transponder hit for the three, CF Kale Conley. So no transponder hitting there for Cale Conley. So we're gonna strap a new one on Conley. Had just a couple of problems with it last night. Gonna give a new transponder to Cale Conley. Brian coming on the crew chief on the 3C. Brian have been a part of more than 10 All-Star Championships and Oxville Nationals win. And he and Cale Conley partnered up two years ago and boy, last year a dream season for Cale. He picked up his first career All-Star win at the Lou Blaney Memorial at Sharon Speedway. And that was an emotional night because Cale is married to Lou Blaney's granddaughter, Emma Blaney. And I believe they've got another baby on the way. But Louis, I'm sure Louis watching dad race tonight, although it might be just about his bedtime. Appreciate everyone coming out tonight. Tomorrow night, hopefully gonna be just a little bit warmer for us. Did you see new transponder going on? Dale Blaney there, strapping the new transponder on. Dale, one of our full-time officials in the 2021 season for the All-Stars. Terry Clausen, he is dialed in in, uh, I believe California is where Terry calls home on Flow Racing. Hi, Terry. Rooting on Sunshine, Tyler Courtney. Right now, Sunshine second quick in time trials. Eric Wilkie's dialed in. Hi, Eric. From Wisconsin, we see Eric drive a pro sprint throughout the year at Knoxville Raceway. My buddy Brendan Bauman's watching. Great photographer. From Illinois, we'll see Brendan in June when we race at Falls, Fairbury International or Fairbury American Legion Speedway. Cannot wait for that in early June, the first weekend of June on Thursday night. Going to be an exciting race. There's Steve Topper. That's the hardest Topper's worked all year. You see him hustling. He's wearing shorts. Topper doesn't care what the temperature is. He's got shorts on. Kenny Osborne down there. Those three guys do a fantastic job. Controlling things on the racetrack in the pit area. Aaron Knoll and Tyler Altmeyer back at the All-Star trailer. Controlling things. Couldn't do it without their help. And, of course, up here in the booth, Brad Hockaday, Ross Paulson, and Eric Walls in race control doing a wonderful job helping the All-Stars get up and down the road. Have to say hi to Jason Carter. Enjoying a blue yummy out in Arizona. Good to see Jason last week out at the Wild West shootout at Arizona Speedway. Good to have the California kid, Mike Leone in the house and Diamond Jim Brady in the house. Couple of legends from Western Ohio, or Eastern Ohio, excuse me. Michael Heiser watching from Schaeferstown, PA, and Brian Miller. He's dialed in, first to 61 races. Yeah, you're, you are right, Ryan. Say hi to Lauren Kelly as well. Lauren does such a great job with PR for several drivers up in Wisconsin, and we'll hear a lot of him. 
this year is Bill Baylog joining the tour once we kip, kick off our points season in April. So these six races here with the Sugarland Shine Southern Tour presented by Elliott's Custom Trailers and Carts are non-point shows for the All-Stars. Jim Jam, the dirt man, he's moved. He's in Wilkesboro, Pennsylvania. We always know he's gonna be here watching. Hi, Jim, it's Cale Conley. Onto the clock now, transponder hitting, so that's good. First lap time for Kale, 12th quick, a 14, 338, 1, 4, 338 for Kale Conley. And second lap time for Kale is better, 14, 0, 32, eighth quick, 1, 4, 0, 3, 2 for Kale Conley. And that'll bring a close to Lincoln Electric Time Trials for the All-Star Circuit of Champions presented by Mobile One. Tenth quick, Carson Short. Ninth quick, Corey Elias. And eighth quick, Kale Conley. Seventh quick, Sam Hafer Teep Jr. Sixth quick, Justin Peck. Fifth quick, Aaron Reitzel. Fourth quick, Gio Selzy. Third quick, Sheldon Hodgeshield. Second quick, Tyler Courtney. And setting Lincoln Electric quick time tonight with a lap of 13.216. How about a round of applause for Donnie Schatz? So opening ceremonies coming up here in a moment, and our order of events will look like this. We'll have Road Warrior heats, then the All-Stars will have four eight-lap heats, then the 602 Bandits will qualify for two laps, and we'll have SCDRA heats, the All-Star Dash, the All-Star B-Main, then the Southeastern Modified Heat Race is eight laps, and then it'll be feature time. Our order of events will be features will be the All-Stars feature first, then the Road Warrior feature 602, Southeastern Modified